Hi, beauty gals and pals. It's me, Tiffany. I am Shane. And we are here for our first movie reaction. I'm excited. I am forcing her to watch stuff that, um, both from my childhood and just stuff in general that she hasn't seen, but she's surprisingly not seen quite a few things. A lot. Now, this movie, uh, A Little Princess, there's actually an original one that came out with like Shirley Temple that was really yeah for real <laughs> that was a black and white and more of a musical this is the more modern adaptation that was okay. like done in like the 90s oh okay so it is uh like i said based like in world world war ii and lots of crying so i'm here to traumatize my friend well that make it all the more sad you said world war ii <laughs> i yeah. know it's sad <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> It's either World War II or World War One. I. I can't remember currently. But I love this movie as a kid. I might have been slightly masochistic. It's fine. We're just we're not we're not we're not we're not gonna touch on it. It's well, fine. I love my friend, so I'm gonna let her <laughs> let her do what she do to me. It's just, this one just has such beautiful cinematography. <laughs> I can English. This one has such beautiful cinematography. Like it's just you'll see. You'll see. We'll see. We're gonna go ahead and get into it. There lived a beautiful princess in a mystical land known as India. This is not a Disney movie. No. It's not, okay. No. <laughs> you see it that way. <laughs> like they haven't traumatized this way. Oh, you don't think it's a Disney movie originally? Now you're making me question things. <laughs> Rama drew a circle in the ground and said to her, This is a magic circle. So long as you stay inside it, no harm can come to you. We just be cheesing the whole way through because it's like just me reminiscing right now watching oh. it. <laughs> as soon as she had the bracelet, the suddenly transformed into the ten headed demon Ravana. <laughs> I was not expecting <laughs> I've told you like such a little information about this movie. Girl, love you. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is gonna take her a minute to get back on track. They're really okay. All right, so 1914. So this is World War One. Okay. It is our right. All women are princesses. It's it is our right. Reiterating that because I talked over the line. <laughs> It's a very important thread throughout the movie, so it needs to be established. <laughs> I mean, I will not deny that, that it kind of does romanticize like the British occupation of India right now, and that's not kosher. <laughs> <laughs> but it's not super long in the movie, so that's better. <laughs> now that England's gone to war, I wanted that bad as a kid. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> your memories just flooding back. <laughs> the same school your mother went to when she was your age, in a city called New York. The distant land of New York City. Are they gonna go into detail about how they ended up in India? That's what I'm talking about—the British occupation kind of oh, stuff. That's okay. that's yeah. Yeah. Um, well, you you the history nigga. I don't know nothing. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I believe that you are, and always will be, my little princess. <laughs> Roll credits. No, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> it really is nice. I don't See? With the little, yeah, I that is it's nice. It's such a pretty bed. Gosh, can you imagine taking a boat all the way to the U.S.? Girl. Ugh. Thanks, my nose. Thanks. Mm -mm. I gave this to you. I barely like going down the street. Don't stay lying for real. <laughs> so it's her, her mother, right? Mm -hmm. When she was still alive. I got that locket when I was a kid. And this movie came out when I was eight years old. The same locket? Mm -hmm. It was like a promotion that came with the movie kind the of thing. The obsession. <laughs> More than anything else, I loved dancing with her. I used to want a monkey. They they used to be so cute to me. <laughs> Until you spend time around them and realize that they're all jerks. <laughs> or just the videos I've been seeing on social media. <laughs> jerks. 
been around a couple when I was over, like, in India and such, and... No. They didn't mean. <laughs> <laughs> it's also weird seeing the, like, like films where you had more so DVDs it, mm-hmm. all in, like, a full screen mode instead of widescreen. Such a cool building, though. Hello. She's having a little friend and fun food. moment. Little... <laughs> Oh, too bad there's not a Niles in this movie. <laughs> <laughs> Captain Crew. <laughs> what? Is that is always Wait weird. Yes, the way she comes down those stairs. It, like, it, what? it literally looked like she was going to the piano keys. <laughs> Did you catch it? Didn't you know the floors were piano <laughs> keys? <laughs> That always weirded me. I'm like, why? <laughs> that was funny. <laughs> that was funny. I think this is probably the movie that made me get terrified of the concept of boarding schools. Oh, so this is a boarding school she's uh-huh. at? Yeah. Because he's getting sent back oh, okay. with the military, right, to go to the front lines. Oh. And she's getting left here, so, you know, she doesn't die. <laughs> <laughs> Like a pee. <laughs> How you gonna just fall asleep like this? Pretending <laughs> like nothing happened. I, know. Oh, I was talking the whole time. No doubt you'll be our most popular student in no time. Now. Hate her already. <laughs> Hate her already. <laughs> You're like, I know. I, I see know you. she. Do you? <laughs> That was ink. I know it. Did shut up. <laughs> you were just keeping yourself <laughs> safe. <something. laughs> I was gonna say something. <laughs> also, I'm afraid jewelry and such finery are not allowed. What if I wore it in my room during my free time? Well, if you absolutely insist. I do. And the fact that she was just gonna grab it off her neck. Exactly. Je m'en. Every time I think of French, I always think of like old Dexter's laboratory and Le Dufourmage. <laughs> <laughs> she giving me Corella Deville vibes. She really is. It's just like she's just putting on. <laughs> <laughs> like, like she put she putting on the show, and as soon as he leave, she's got some gorgeous stuff though. My gosh. Thing I want to say real quick. So they they. Focused on the little girl who is a servant, right? Mm-hmm. To highlight like the slavery type of thing, you know, mm-hmm. like kind of stuff going on. Well, I mean, like, then like slavery was illegal, but her acting like she hadn't seen it before again is ignoring the whole thing in India where that happened, and that's exactly what what they would have experienced while they were in India, just, For by, real? just by Indian mm. people instead. Oh yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. So it's like, okay, writers, I know what you're trying to do. Because you kind of missed it a little bit. Yeah. Yeah, when you sit and think, yeah. <laughs> I don't mean to, like, ruin it, but I can't, like, thought. <laughs> because they can't speak doesn't mean they don't listen. They come to life. They do? That's where Tor Story got inspired. I don't know for real, but I think my it is. My daddy been not, been not ever telling me my toys come to life. They haven't seen Chucky, so <laughs> <laughs> the different connotation. Mm-hmm. Was Toy Story Sid had the evil toys. They weren't evil. They were just misunderstood. Sid was the one that was evil. Well, he, well, yeah, he made them evil. He made them evil looking. They were helpful. Well, evil looking, yeah. Judging people by the way they look. Shit. Well, <laughs> you wouldn't either, especially the hooker. You remember the hooker? You know. <laughs> I was like, this is a super like emotional scene we're talking about. I know. <laughs> it's all right, Papa. The thing that breaks my heart about those situations is like back in those times, it was so much easier to lose people because mm-hmm. it was so much harder to get in contact mm-hmm. and and know. Especially since he knows he's going to war. 
It's crazy. But for them, it was like, you know, it was normal to like go six, seven months without speaking or seeing. Like that was normal for them. Like that's so crazy nowadays. But like that's how like like child abuse and stuff like that would be so easy for mm-hmm. stuff to go oh, like yeah. the run. Because like who, who's going to advocate exactly. for them? But like it makes sense that he would take her all the way back to the U.S. Because I mean the war didn't touch ground over yeah. there. Oh. The father grows crackers or something. They're very rich. They must be. Everyone I know eats crackers. The father's Jeez. British. I heard he's best friends with the king and queen. Ha! Huh. Well, I heard he was thrown out of India because people died from eating his poison crackers. <laughs> she about ready to fight, little girl. <laughs> <laughs> Before we walk in and catch them, they return to their place as quick as lightning. The hair bows make me think that they should be placed in the south instead of New York. <laughs> that size I of the know, bow. <laughs> a big bow just slapped on the head. Mama. Sarah, we're not accustomed to delaying everyone's breakfast for one student. I'm sorry, Miss Minchin, but I found my mom. You're mom's... not the only child here, Sarah. You must remember that. You will begin French lessons with him this afternoon. Mm-mm-mm. Do I have to? Sarah. You most certainly do. Monsieur, je regrette. He looking at her like, girl. This child doesn't need to learn French. She practically is French. I'm sorry, but we tried to tell you. And she might just be able to help you with your pronunciation, Miss Meechin. Girl, she ain't like that. (laughs) (laughs) She ain't like that. Such cute little girls. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Sarah, there's no talking at the table. Doesn't seem natural. I agree with her, though. Yeah. <laughs> Dumb girls. You know, why would you just sit there and not say anything? It's all like this awkward. Yeah, they're just what sitting there just, just, and just eating your food and just hearing like the yes. cutlery like hitting the plates. <laughs> I'm sorry, Miss Minchin. I studied for hours last night. I find that very hard to believe. And I imagine your father will as well. Please don't tell him, Miss Minchin. See, I, I had a college professor who was like that, like... Won't they embarrass you? Yes, like they, they found, they got their kicks out of out it. Out of it. it so gross. And that's so crazy to me. I'm like, your job is to teach me what you already know. You don't be a butthole about it if I don't know it. You, I, st- I don't know. I, I still stand by the concept that if your students are failing and you're they're the trying, problem. yeah, you as a teacher you're, have failed. Yeah. That's your job. You're the problem. Your job is to help them to learn. Mm-hmm. Now, it's one thing if the kids are actively cutting up and not trying, then yeah. like, but you can tell. Yes. You can, like, that little girl, she's clearly trying. Yes. And you aren't doing your job because you were a crap teacher. <laughs> you could have easily just, I mean, that could have went so many different ways. You didn't have to do all that. Mm hmm. Now, now, Lottie, you, you mustn't get so upset. Stop screaming. How uh, about a cookie? Would you like that? <laughs> it's so weird coming back and watching this as an adult and thinking of like how differently I would respond. Girl! I'm just like, mm. <laughs> It's very hard to study with you carrying on like this. I want my mama! She's dead and I won't ever see her again! I don't have a mother either. Poor baby. Where is she? In heaven. With my baby sister. And I know she hears me. How? Because that's what angels do. And when the angels want to go someplace, they just whistle like this. (laughs) <laughs> Until they're hovering right above us. Hey, wait! That's Becky. She's not allowed to talk to us. Why not? She's a servant girl. And she has dark skin. So? Well, doesn't that mean something? See, Miss Clark, see... She repeating it, but she don't even understand yeah. what she repeating. She's she just, she like, just been told. She's yeah, like, she's just been told. Know. I don't know. I just know I can't talk to her. That the innocence of well, kids yeah, just been like, well, I'm that's trusting crazy. that the adults know what they're talking about. That is crazy. Mm-hmm. I'm 
sorry I didn't Is there anything I can do for you, miss? I just came up here to change my shoes. You hurt. My face, Lord. I, I want to thump this lady. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> it hasn't even gotten to the bad stuff yet. <laughs> I can only imagine. Mm -hmm. I do love the music in this movie. <laughs> It just like it just fits it so well. Oh, no, she can't worry him though. Nowhere but in there. Mm hmm. Oh, my heart <laughs> must prevail at all costs. But even she's out there. <laughs> I would have been too, because she reading it boring. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Lavinia. Sarah, you may take your turn. I didn't realize how much of myself was, was shaped by this movie, because there was so much I identified with. <laughs> <laughs> Sarah. Charlotte turned to her father and said, Father, you are right. <laughs> but I simply won't do it. I'm sorry, Father. But when I marry, it will be for love. And with that, Charlotte ran from the house, yeah. whom Charlotte secretly adored. We're halfway there. <laughs> Their ship was attacked by a band of pirates. That's how you do that. Ignore her. A group of mermaids appear and rescue them. <laughs> what are you doing? I couldn't bear to see Charlotte marry that awful man. She need to. I suppose that's rather easy for a child who has everything. Mm. Hi, oh, Lavinia can get it. <laughs> you didn't realize this was going to be a, a try not to swear challenge. <laughs> <laughs> she just, she tuned up her nut like she's something. Girl, sit down somewhere. You in a boarding school just like I am. You have to do something about this communication. <laughs> right, girl. Michael Tant, Devlevoir. Perfect. And he hates coming here. Says he doesn't belong. What? What? Okay. Well, I mean, like, think about it this way. Like, especially in this environment, it was very much the upper class that you had to have a certain type of poise to be accepted into polite society. Oh, so she's poor, or well, her daddy's poor. Well, I'm assuming that they they may not be the full, the, high the class. highest class, oh, so he probably okay. feels lesser, would be my assumption. Oh, okay. And so he's like, I want to make sure you aren't ousted because you don't oh, have that okay, same yeah. breeding. My little girl, she spoke French. <laughs> That's horrible. Yeah. Gosh, and these these would have been like his friends, you know? Mm -hmm. It's not like they're just random bodies going by. These are people he would have known. <laughs> That's it. I can't take it anymore. I don't care what you say about Sarah's stories. They've got to be more fun than watching your hair being combed. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Feels the same way. I think she should leave too. <laughs> That's what you get. <laughs> the wide eyes. <laughs> she looked like. I didn't, I didn't really. Oh, get it. She like, I didn't want to do it again. Uh -huh. <laughs> got exactly what you asked for. I'm sure Princess Sarah will give everyone a fair share. Right, Princess? All girls are princesses. Even snotty two-faced bullies like you, Lavinia. 
Hmm. Man, you should have threw her in there too, cause she a bully too. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lavinia. She couldn't touch my cake. She couldn't even breathe next to it. She'll have to get out. She couldn't get no. <laughs> okay, but like, look at the balloon motif that we have in there: green, white, and black. <laughs> <laughs> Does that scream happy birthday? <laughs> Miss Minchin. Yes, may I help you? I'm Mr. Barrow, Captain Crew's solicitor. Oh, we're just celebrating little Sarah's birthday. May I speak to you in private? Oh, yes, of course. Right this way. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> so I swear Miss Minchin bought those balloons because she got an extra discount because no one wanted those colors. <laughs> Your check to us this month will be rather large. There will be no check, Miss Minchin. Excuse me? Mm. Look at her. She can't wait to do something. She the only one that's not participating. <laughs> like, you're just like, you're on entry, just like, I'm watching you. I'm watching you, Lavinia. Mm. I know. <laughs> is over. Amelia, go to Sarah's room and find a simple black dress. I'm afraid I have some bad news, Sarah. Your father... It's been discovered that your father has died. He was killed in battle several weeks ago, leaving you penniless, without any money. And since you have no relations to speak of, this puts me in a terrible position. She lying. I feel like she's lying. I told you it got worse. She lying. I might be wrong. Heard. She lying. Everything you own now belongs to me. Your clothes, your toys, everything. Though it will hardly make up for the financial losses I have suffered. From now on, you must earn your room and board here. You will move to the attic with Becky and work as a servant. Mm-hmm. She just lost her father, and this is what. This is how she's she giving me like has charity Cinderella, towards her. Cinderella vibes, mm -hmm. girl. She's very Miss Tremaine in a lot of things. Five a.m. Solitary candle to help light your room. I could have you arrested for taking this. <gasps> but another incident like this, and I will call the authorities. <laughs> You're not a princess any longer. This making me more mad than sad. It's understandable. <laughs> this is making me mad. Mm -hmm. It's understandable. Because it's, oh my gosh. Like I said, the try not to, to curse that challenge. <laughs> <laughs> Things you want to say. And then just so cold with it. And it's like... Girl. The room okay. that's got leaks and all this kind of stuff and just I don't remember the circle that Rama and her mm -hmm. story drew. Sarah will be working here as a servant from now on. There will be no communication exchanged. Gosh. The abuse. <laughs> wow. That absolute abuse. And the factor that none of the other adults bat an eye. Mm -hmm. So it's like Miss Minchin is evil, but like the others are complicit in it. <laughs> what are you thinking? <laughs> that bucket was to the back of her head so quick. I was like, it's either gonna be, I was either going to be the mop or the bucket that she's going to want to tackle. <laughs> that bucket would be in the back of her head so quick. <laughs> and looky, just see all the money that Miss Minchin is getting for talking the kid, like those care of those girls, because like those aren't all poor kids exactly. that are there, right? Exactly. Well, yeah. She's only using child servants. Just, just in just two to run the house. Mm -hmm. 
just two kids. Mm-hmm. Because she can get away with using less money that way. Threads, that's the river. Oh, the sacrifice for her to do that because, like, she wouldn't exactly. have gotten across those stitches that easily with the thread and everything. Oh my gosh, why don't you tell your stories anymore? They're just make believe. There were days I thought I would die until I heard you talk about the magic. There is no magic, Becky rips out your heart it's like she's not trying to be mean but she just stole the last mm -hmm. yeah for bit of like hope oh, becky mm -hmm. had bet if miss mention had a man she wouldn't be so <laughs> 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 Get in line. Oh my gosh. Got them cooking and everything. It looks like it smells good though. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Don't touch that. The Mr. Randolph next door. The poor man. His son is missing in action over in Europe, you know. You mean John? Oh, he's such a nice boy. Back, yeah. I told you, you to get away. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Just like a key. <laughs> Excuse me. Excuse me. You see, you'll never get rid of them. She's trying to give it back. What I would have, you won't want it. I bet I eat good. It would have been more significant if it had been a sunflower, though. <laughs> I mean, I'm just, no, I, I'm, I wasn't trying to be funny. I was just saying. <laughs> Sweet and poignant, but not poignant. No. <laughs> Better flower options stage manager. Mm -hmm. Come on. <laughs> Gosh. Leave it to me. At least they had a yellow flower, yes. so it's still bright mm -hmm. and cheery. Yeah. my turn to be that person um thing that always bugged me ever since i was a kid when they open that door they're gonna break the flower really really <laughs> no. tell me about it sarah Tell me again about India. <laughs> no, it's never this cold, but it is a melt your face hot. <laughs> the air is so hot there. You can almost taste it. It's more like spices, really. Not Curry like and saffron. It's like a bit hot. You can taste the, the spices. They're, they're romanticizing the heat, but <laughs> it's not <laughs> worth romanticizing. <laughs> Girl. <laughs> when you get well over a hundred degrees Fahrenheit in the shade. Oh, no, I'm good. Mm -hmm. We be thinking that we be dying down here in the south. Oh, right. no. I mean, can have beautiful land and everything, but like, mm -hmm. I'm not the person who's ever going to romanticize heat. <laughs> you too pale for heat. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm also not a huge fan of super cold either, so I'm just like stuck indoors, <laughs> which just keeps me Hermit pale forever. You could fool me. <laughs> <laughs> you so bad that you don't like the cold. What's this? You stay inside so you don't get any sun. 
So I, you know, I'm just a couple stages above albino. It's fine. <laughs> It's like here, like they were making this like beautiful, poignant, finding joy and hardship things. And I'm sitting here and be like, close that window and get under the cover. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Though I do get that that would be a really big deal to her to have someone who reminds her of her mm -hmm. home in India. My her own personal snow globe. I know she would be easy. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is our methodology of keeping yourselves getting into a place where you start feeling the heartstrings. Just make the jokes and you can't yeah. get invested into the pain. <laughs> Cover the pain with sarcasm. <laughs> that would be so cold. way to start your morning. Uh, and you can forget being paid this week. Uh, oh no, you don't. I told you I wouldn't tolerate the slightest bit of soot in this house. And there, just look at my boot. It's filthy. Seems like he already did his believe? job. And yeah. she just... Well, she believe in using children, don't she? She ain't gonna lift a finger. Mm-hmm. Wow. Ooh, child labor. I wonder when child labor laws came into effect. I honestly don't oh, know. No. We can Google it after this is done. We'll definitely have to. Yes! 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 Yes, she did! Yes! Now you clean it up! <laughs> got to get up early if he wants to have an effect on the world. How true. Okay, me and Leo. Not as powerful as you do, apparently. I know. <laughs> <laughs> the made me run off. He Without me me the book. I thought it was uh Miss Mitchy coming down. She shot off so quickly. <laughs> I know what I'm talking about, girl. You gotta play it cool. Like you wouldn't just watch it. <laughs> you gotta play it cool. <laughs> she got bad. <laughs> so to see. Mm -hmm. Where have you been? I've been chilled for almost half an hour. Hurry up and light a fire. Ugh. What is buff smell? Your attitude. What are you doing? I don't believe in that. So you can just stop it. Stop it, I said! But she doesn't believe in it. So exactly. It <laughs> what did you just do? Just a little curse I learned from a witch back in India. Curse? Ha! What kind of curse? You'll see, but I wouldn't brush my hair as much if I were you. Yeah, play with her mental a little bit. <laughs> <laughs> see, she wanna, hmm, okay. Oh, is this where you live? You shouldn't be here, Ermengarde. It's too dangerous. Sarah, why don't you like me anymore? Did I do something wrong? See. No, of course not. I didn't think you'd want me for a friend. Now that, now that things are different. Sarah, no. I'm sure you could do just fine without me for a friend, but I couldn't get along without you. Oh, oh my God. I'm sorry. I should have known you wouldn't be like the others. Three knocks means the coast is clear. The demon Minchin Weed is asleep. <laughs> <laughs> Not a perfect word. Is this what she? I love their sass. It's so good. <laughs> Won't you tell us what happened to Rama and the princess? Rama lay dead on the ground. Oh, no. But then, 
a wonderful thing happened. The gazelle lay down next to Rama, giving him his own life. Since your son was the only name unaccounted for, they assume this must be John. I am sorry. Well, it's crazy. They truly had no way of really identifying nobody, so yeah. they probably sent people home with the wrong pe girl. Especially if they've been damaged yes. by the war, like without How facial recognition know? and everything. Like, what would he have seen? Pain, Sahib. He needs to be cared for. He's not my responsibility. A wise man would remember that this soldier was in John's regiment. If his memory returns, he might tell Sahib what happened to his son. Hello, Miss Minchin. Goodbye, Miss Minchin. Very not suspicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> No, they just. <laughs> but she's so caught up in her own stank, she don't even recognize me. Look at her. <laughs> I'm her. I'm her. Like, yeah, yeah, the boss gone. Let's chill real quick. <laughs> Let's find the locket. Oh, that was sweet. Right? They're Look, all coordinating. She, I like how she tiptoeing up to her like she is. <laughs> Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Okay, now I understand. <laughs> She's got a spider. That girl got some strong lungs, boy. Oh, they have Who knows how long she's been doing those temper tantrums before. Sarah came. run away together and get married. <laughs> She's been thinking about uh -huh. that. Uh-huh. My sister would be furious if she found out. So? You'd be long gone by then. Stuff your sister. Mm -hmm. You know, she wouldn't spend the money to come after you. She'd exactly. be fine. <laughs> <laughs> Got a daydreaming. Uh-huh. <laughs> She's like, I could be free of that? Mm -hmm. Girl, get out. <laughs> Please. It's not like you're staying to help the girls anyway. <laughs> Going to sleep and stuff. <laughs> the way that she was able to break through their fear of Miss Minchin. Mm -hmm. So that they would risk everything mm -hmm. for her. What's going on? It's a surprise. I think it just shows you how That's starved happened, for kindness they were. Person. Mm hmm Princess Sarah, we'd like to present you with something we rescued. 
in a most dangerous adventure. Our very own crusade. Risking all our lives. And mine, too. <laughs> hey, yo, long. <laughs> <laughs> she did some of the heavy lifting right there. Yeah. <laughs> she did all the work. They just go, what? Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Right next door. Look, Hanuman likes to come and visit me all the time. Illegal animal trade. No, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Black market. <laughs> oh. Nobody double checked to see if she was asleep. I think we better save the rest of the story for later. But it's very on brand for little girls that age because you know they suck at staying quiet. Yeah. <laughs> Especially in a big old group of them like that. What's going on here? It's not their fault. I asked them to come. You will remain locked in your room for the entire day tomorrow without meals. Go! As if you was feeding her anyway. Mm. All her chores, in addition to your own, without breakfast, lunch, or dinner. The real life has nothing to do with your little fantasy games. It's a cruel, nasty world out there. And it's our duty to make the best of it. Not to indulge in ridiculous dreams, but to be productive and useful. Do you understand what I'm saying? <laughs> but I don't believe in it. I would have told her, speak slower. <laughs> speak slower, I don't get it. I am a princess. All girls are. Even if they live in tiny old attics. Even if they dress in rags. Even if they aren't pretty or smart or young. They're still princesses. All of us. Didn't your father ever tell you that? Didn't he? If I find you up here with any of the girls again, I will throw you out into the street! Well, it hurt your feelings, didn't it? Mm-hmm. That's the Holy Spirit getting the Holy Spirit. <laughs> <laughs> <You know? laughs> I need to, girl. Just, I mean, they're just like, like, okay, so what kind of trauma did she experience? Yeah, that... she's just so evil. It's the cold, cruel world. It's really not. Your world is cold and cruel. So tell me you got daddy issues. <laughs> <laughs> I got no place to go. It's not true. I'm here with you. I've always thought of us as sisters. You have? Let's make a promise right now to always look out for each other. It's a promise. Now, what are we going to do about food? Starve, I guess. No, <laughs> there's only one thing to do. We'll eat a great feast before we go to sleep, and that will keep us full all day tomorrow. Come on, Becky. Tell me what kind of food there is. But I don't see any food. Try, Becky. Don't play with me with my food now. <laughs> Don't do that. See, that's, what, that's what I always thought too. It's like, it's like, I know the idea. It's like they think, okay, this will make us more full. But then we like, make me more hungry. Oh, yes. <laughs> Cause I'm like, oh, now I want this. <laughs> Muffins? Good. What kind? All kinds. Every kind of muffin God ever made. Muffin <laughs> God. We're not dressed right for such an elegant banquet. I'm wearing a long banquet full of muffins. Yeah. 
It's like they did. They did really get <laughs> like how little kids are Yay, when they play pretend and everything. It's like I need to be dressed all fancy <laughs> for my muffin feast. Yeah. There's your sunflowers. <laughs> <laughs> I see you too. Thank you. You're welcome. You're welcome. Here for you. <laughs> it's the only thing I can think of is that, like they have to have gone based upon magic because how else did that dude get all that in there without exactly <laughs> waking without him waking him up? the bed and everything? Like not just like the blankets, but like they're on. I feel what I'm saying. The sheets, sheets the pillow, like everything. That food does look good, though. Mm, really do. <laughs> like the work to get those linens up on the walls. <laughs> For real? He must have sprayed some sleeping dust or something. I'm a little scared about all of this. Me too. That. You think we shouldn't eat it? I'm not that scared. Exactly. Ain't that scared now? Wait a minute now. Ain't that scared? Let's eat, girl. <laughs> You're like, well, if I'm gonna die, I'll die happy. It's exactly. fine. <laughs> Why not? It's her. We're gonna indulge while we can. <laughs> I'm so sorry to inconvenience you. It is nothing, Sahib. That word. It sounds so familiar, and yet I don't know what it means. You know who that is, right? Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Just making sure. I knew she was one because of the way she said it. Tell him your father's dead. Girl, bye. He was just more so missing. Missing? Missing an action. <laughs> I can't words. No. Everything's just a blur. <sighs> He's right freaking next door. I know he. You will say it. You will. What gets me is like, I swear he knows, but he's not saying anything. Mm -hmm. I'll just let the little girl suffer because he's going to figure it out for himself. Why are all the adults crap? <laughs> <laughs> Negligence all over the place. Girl, go get your man, girl, <laughs> yes. She said she dipping out. You a grown woman. I would live. You tell me what to do. <laughs> and the fact that only her sister has the keys. He can't. Yes, he can't. <laughs> he can't whistle. Girl, go get your man. <laughs> go get your man, girl. She coming. She coming. <laughs> Oh, he's so happy. <laughs> she didn't warn him at all. <laughs> the things you do for her. She got full that. faith in him. Mm -hmm. That would live out the window too. Oh, we should go backwards too. Not even making sure. Oh my god. Yeah, go catch her. Go catch her. Francis? Yeah, you, you, about, you was about to lead her without no man. Then quit. <laughs> <laughs> then quit. Where is it? Where's the locket? Give it to me. Give it to me! What is all this? Just like you stole this locket! No! You're nothing but a dirty little thief. You'll be leaving with the police very shortly. Recognize her voice. You heard me. I want her picked up immediately. You gonna call the police on a child, bro? You are. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh yeah. <clears throat> you know what I just thought about? She saw a picture of her mama on the wall. Mm -hmm. Do you think? 
Like they knew well, each other or something? No, not... Well, I know what I'm trying to say. You think she got a vendetta against her mama, so she's taking it out on her? Yeah. I, I don't, maybe. It could be. Oh, oh, they never went into depth about her? Oh, mm -hmm. okay. Oh, they just going to gloss over that one little detail that her pictures was... Oh, I thought they were going to go in detail a little bit. Now, that means why she went to the school, because her mom went to the school here, mm -hmm. right? Oh, okay. Why would you have any faith in adults after all that you've exactly. dealt with? Exactly. The police, they're here. For a child. Are, Are you, you kidding me? Mm -hmm. Help me with this board. Like this way. And all of that. That that many people. For a child, girl, you. She's like what ten? She's such a thief. That okay. Needed five officers. I can do it. I'll come back for you. Becky, you could have healed you. I was, you I was, I was, I was thinking that is something that's always bothered me. It's like, <laughs> your sister, at least hold it. She didn't even have to kneel down. She just got to put her foot on it, you know? Mm. Just stick out her foot and all like, well, no one's watching. Just be like, mm. <laughs> I could never. My upper body strength. Oh, no, I'd be dead. Yeah, I'd be dead so fast. <laughs> and in the rain, no less. Yeah. Like, all that grip is gone. Mm -mm. See, if we just going to stir at each other on the way down. <laughs> I ain't going to scream like, I'll see you in a minute. <laughs> You're at it. What? Just like, just going to pick. What y'all going to do? Throw the kids in jail? They, they just... would too back then. They would too. Oh my goodness. Man, he he gotta be magic or something. Oh, yeah, take her to jail. Hmm. You see the different school name mm -hmm. now. Old man bought it. She, I hope she went to jail. Should have made her a servant. That's how you do that. Should have <laughs> made her a servant. They released all my property back to me. I just came to say goodbye, sir. And to thank you. No more than you tried to do for my son. No, oh, so that was his son and he was, mm -hmm. um, okay. Yeah. And the way the government just like snatched up all his stuff as soon as he went missing in yes. action. Yes! Oh, shady. Where the oh the little demon is? <laughs> Where she? <laughs> Whenever you think of me. Oh, she down the one friend. <laughs> it's her hair brusher. <laughs> yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> I like the slack chalk looks from the others. <laughs> 
That's how it really be. They really be liking you, but they be too, they be too envious to say something. Mm -hmm. She was totally encouraged by. <laughs> yeah, oh, oh yeah. Coming. <laughs> ah, that's what I'm talking about. He said, I've been waiting. I've been looking for you, Mitch. <laughs> That's what I'm talking about. <laughs> he said, I've been looking for you, Mitch. <laughs> great. Then the whistle there to say, get over. Nice. This is such a sweet movie. Stop there. Stop there. Stop there. That was nice. I liked it. I hadn't realized. I hadn't really thought and sat and thought about it, but like how much that movie shaped me. <laughs> like, <laughs> intensely. It's so like I I was obsessed. The idea of like uh so like I said, I got that movie as um a birthday present when I was eight years old. Really? Yes, and it, it like it came with the locket. It was like this special VHS tape to age mass sale. <laughs> <laughs> and I did. I got obsessed with that movie. I mean, part of it was is that I that was at an age in which I was reading a lot of like the American Girl Diary kind mm -hmm. of stories. Okay. And so all those things that were very based on historical concepts and like the hardships of life and mm -hmm. like Oregon Trail and slavery and servanthood and you know all that kind Oregon of stuff. Oregon Trail is sad. Yes. <laughs> I also was obsessed with the game as a kid too. But you know like <laughs> a, a little bit of a dark 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 um obsession you know in my own way. It's fine. Um, you know, played orphan as a child a lot. Um, <laughs> <laughs> I know you were loved. Why were you seeking trauma? I, you know, I, <laughs> it was dramatic. <laughs> it was just a drama. I was obsessed with the drama. Um, <laughs> but like also like the, the um, I think that I also helped to stir it up like the, the love for telling stories. Because mm -hmm. I love that about her with how she was just so passionate and just and how mm -hmm. not only did she love telling stories but like how her stories gave hope to mm -hmm. people and united them in massively and like you know like with, like with Becky sitting there saying that uh, before your stories yeah. there were days I thought I would I die. die yeah it's just it's so funny because I hadn't really sat and thought about it before. I was like oh my gosh this really because <laughs> when it was it was when I was eight years old that I realized that I wanted to become a writer oh okay so this movie kind of like kind of in a way like helped with it mm-hmm formed a lot <laughs> a lot more than i realized <laughs> well you just needed to watch it with your adult eyes yes that's what it was well that's the fun thing about coming back and watching these movies like when way on later and saying oh that's where i got that from but i, I always loved that sarah didn't just take the crap yeah mm, yeah she did she stood up for herself in more ways than one <laughs> <laughs> yeah, because I'm so I couldn't deal with Miss Minchin. Yeah, she would be a. I can't say what I want to say, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh. It just. It, it's very satisfying, the like, the end result for. Oh, oh most <laughs> definitely. You see how happy I got? Yes. <laughs> I'm all, I'm all for people getting their karma. Oh, I, I love the factor too that like because it's like like I said when I was watching it I I would ball as a kid and everything but that's also because I would often put myself in Sarah's place a whole mm -hmm. lot like you know if I were to have lost everything and everyone yeah. and that fear and that abandonment all those kind of things so I would feel that but it's so funny coming back to it now and again <laughs> as an adult and being like Freaking all the adults suck. Yes. All, all of because them. Because she didn't, she didn't have to go through none of that at all. None of it. Even the... Just the, the evil woman who needed a man. Oh she, that's all it was. The, the Indian guy next door, he knew. I would say you... And he knew. didn't go, like, didn't try to be like, hey, Sarah, your daddy over here, like, nothing. No. He's yeah, like, all the adults in this movie kind of... Ooh. Like, her dad was great. Yeah. I mean, well, he didn't know. You yeah, can't, he, 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 he not, didn't know. He, he can't really fault him for having amnesia. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, everybody else, though, I mm -mm. 
gosh, so mad. And so it's just so funny because like, I'm like, oh yeah, I'll make you cry. You're too busy being pissed <laughs> off. <at this laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm, but you know, I'm not, I mean, it was, it was some parts that was, you know, like, kind of sad but I was I ain't gonna I was I was more focused on bro I don't I don't I don't like this lady I don't like this lady she making her suffer and she don't have to I don't like this lady <laughs> Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed what you saw, please make sure to like this video. And for some more great content, click subscribe. If there are other shows or movies you want us to react to, leave a comment below. Thanks again for watching, and we'll see you next time.